Hi, this is Tor's eight month update. I am doing it on the webcam because we're still trying to trying to get all of our information so that we can start making videos <laughs> on the thing again. We just have on the um, camera again. But I wanted to do is up eight months, so I'm doing it on here. I'm sorry for the crappy quality. First of all, as you could see just then, um, although he was holding on to me, you can't really see, but Tor is standing, and I don't mean just what he's been doing, because he's, for the, his whole, for the majority of his seventh month, he's been kind of standing up for a second, and then he'll fall down on his butt, but now, maybe he'll do it while we're on the camera, there he goes, wait, I'll shoot, there he is, now he can stand up, and he, uh, He's on the bed now, so it's a little hard, but he can stand up like that, but he doesn't fall down. Instead, he just kind of stands for a good while, and then he'll, like, slowly lower himself down. So, he really is handy. Um, he can walk with his little dino walker, his little dinosaur walker, and I feel like walking is not too far off. I feel like by nine months, he should be able to walk, if not sooner, because he's uh, really you know, at an exponential rate. He's just, you know, trying and doing different things. We just got back from New York City. We were there uh, a few days. Like, we actually got back on the 6th, and then he had his uh, eight-month eight month birthday on the... There he is. We had his, he had his eight-month birthday. Yeah, you did your big boy. Ooh, sorry, did I distract you? He had his eight-month birthday on the 7th, and... Um, he was doing this just a couple days before that, and it's pretty crazy. So he's eight months old. Let's see, I'm trying to think of what else. Well, he's still, he's been able to crawl for a while now, since about 24 weeks. He started kind of doing the back and forth, and then he officially started crawling it around uh, maybe 29 weeks, somewhere around there, 29, 30 weeks. And he's been crawling since then perfectly. He um, can cruise, so when he's, he can pull himself up, he can sit himself up. He's been doing that again since like six months. He, when he pulls himself up, he can cruise along things, so he can walk from side to side along things. He's really fast at crawling now. He kind of does this like ape crawl where he uses like, he has, like one leg up. He's constantly trying to stand like now. Um, like I said, if he uses his little dinosaur walker, he can walk. Uh, with that, so he definitely has the ability to walk, he's just got to work on his balance a little bit so that he can do it on his own, and I think being able to stand is, you know, the next the next step is to take a few steps, right? Right, boo-boo? Yeah, right, that's right, boo-boo, you did a big Love you, love you. Um, he's really cute, of course, as always. He's, um, babbling a lot more these days, and it's kind of become a little bit more conver conversational. So I don't know what he's trying to say exactly, but he loves it. He loves to babble. He has a lot of books that he loves. He got a bunch of books from his grandparents and some from friends. He really loved everybody out in New York. He had such a great time meeting, you know, my Aunt Wendy and my grandma and, um, seeing my sister and all of our friends, just like amazing friends that we have. So he really enjoyed that. He did come back with, he got his first, uh, his first virus, which uh, was, is, is not a first that's enjoyable, but uh, we got through it. He had a fever for about three days. It was going, you know, anywhere from like 101.5 to 103, and I had to give him a lot of, uh, you know, little cooling sponge baths and like uh, some baby uh, Tylenol. I give him little red little remedies, fever medicine. That's what I was giving him. And uh, then he got a little bit of a rash on his head, but now he seems to be back to his old self pretty much. He's regressed. I don't even want to say regressed because he never used to do this, but he's gotten a little weird about solids. Like instead of me feeding him something, like giving him the spoon and him taking it, putting it right in his mouth, or opening his mouth right away for food because he's wearing to go to eat. He's become picky and strange, which I'm not happy about because I was hoping that he would be a, not a picky eater because he didn't seem to be a picky eater before. But, yeah, he's 
not really wanting to eat a lot of solids right now, maybe because he was sick, so maybe that'll change. And um, he prefers to eat off my plate or things that I give him that are real food to, to like the baby food right now. He'll eat the pouches a little bit, but even that he's kind of playing with, and I don't know. It's been a bit, it's been a bit weird with the solids, so I don't know what that means. Let's just see a chance to see him standing. I don't know what that means exactly, but he's um, he's acting weird with the with the solids. If any of you know or have gone through that with your babies, let me know what what that might mean because uh, he's he's nursing fine, um, but you know he used to love his medicine too, and he didn't like taking his medicine when he was sick. I think he's just feeling bad. Maybe maybe it had an effect on him. In that way, um, let's see, what else? What else is going on with you, mister? Um, we went to FAO Schwartz when we were out there, which was really fun. He saw Iron Man, and he got a really cool animal doll. Um, he got to play with our friend's baby. We stayed with my friend who has a baby named Hava, and he got to play with her, and she's, like, walking around and, you know, really, you know, poignant things and really super, super comprehensive of, on everything, so it was neat to see that and to see her. She's uh, almost one and a half, not quite one and a half. And what are you doing? Did you find something? Did you find a thing? This is the, the uh, return that never was. I got this, uh, got this and it was came broken and I was going to return it and then it just never happened, so now it's ours forever. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all I can say about his eight months. He's been going outside a lot. He's been enjoying interacting with things. Yeah, boo-boo. I think he's really enjoying his own image in the camera right now. Yeah. Yeah, do you enjoy yourself? You're so cute. Oh, and he high-fives. Let's see if he'll do it. High-five, Tor. Tor. Tor, high-five. High five. Ah, sort of. <laughs> High five, Tor. High five. Ah, yay! And he was, he he kind of claps a little a little bit too. You want to clap? Clap, 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 clap. clap, clap. <laughs> He's super silly. Super silly. He loves drumming too. You drumming on mommy? Drumming? <laughs> there you go. Stand up. Stand up and be counted. Anyway, that's what we're doing in our, up, our eight month update. Um, I'll try to post more videos as soon as I can. Mm. All right.